standing six feet one inch tall and weighing in at 199 pounds. Please welcome to the cage, Jason Flynn. We got Jason Flynn, 6'1", 199. He's young, another young one, 21 years old, coming out of Idaho. Um, he's a blue belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, uh, does some freestyle wrestling. 7-0, we'll see what he's all about. I got a Rancho Cucamonga, California. He is undefeated in NHB competition. Standing six feet, one inch tall, and weighing in at 190 pounds, please welcome Brian Painter. Well, Brian Painter's 22 years old. Um, he's a shoot fighter, 1-0, no holds barred fighting. Um, he has a wrestling background. Um, he says he wants to perform to his potential, so he's, he's a pretty humble guy. And, uh, and you know he's uh, he's well versed in leg locks. He's coming out of the Shark Tank. Um, he likes to ground and pound. I talked to him earlier. Um, he feels really comfortable in guards. Likes to ground and pound. But he's got a he's got leg locks for you. You know that. Your opponent is uh, Jason Flynn. Uh, what do you think his strategy is tonight? Um, you know he's gonna try and use his guard against me. You know I think uh, he's a good Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, and uh, he's gonna use you know arm bar neck, something to choke me out in. How do you think wrestlers need to evolve to become more successful in no-holds-barred fighting? I think wrestlers are really aggressive, and they, and they put themselves out there, and they're not, they're not as careful as, you know, uh, most fighters. They put themselves out there on the limit lines, and they cross over into uh, danger zones, you know, and they get themselves caught. You know, they're just so aggressive, they're, they're constantly aggressing, and uh, they need to be a little less cautious and use their head a little bit better. Jason Flynn definitely going to try to take it down to the ground. He doesn't want to uh, mix it up with Ryan. Little short shots. Jason Flynn definitely wants to go down. What do you think? You think Jason should be throwing some knees here? I, mean, um, I don't, think he, I don't think he can get the knee out right now from this position. You really need to get your elbows inside to use the knee. Oh, he's got him in a little uh, arm lock now, there. Now they're down on the ground. Jason Flynn on his back. Let's see what kind of guard he has. Does he have an offensive guard? Does he have a defensive guard? We'll find out. Don't kick the face. Do not kick the face. Do not kick the face, guys. Do not kick the face. Body only. Body and legs only. Well, you know what? It looks like Jason oh. Flynn wants to take it to the ground, but he doesn't want to be on his back. He definitely wants to take him down and end up on top. Oh! oh. Right Beautiful hand right hand. Beautiful. He's got his back. He, oh. I mean, uh, why? He, that was a good right hand by Flynn. Yeah, definitely. Painter is stunned. But he looks like he's done a pretty good uh, recovery job here. He's actually pulled it to, uh, back together. Oh, oh no right he's, hand. He's grabbing, trying to get uh, get his uh, bearings again. Wow, he, he's just gonna. Wow, another right hand. Flynn should continue to shoot those shots to the chin like that. I mean, when you got your opponent stunned, you don't want to let him off the hook. Painter just definitely just holding on. He's surviving. Oh, great judo takedown. Wow. <laughs> what did I say? Surviving? He just oh! Great fight. No, he got reversed. Yeah, he, uh, Jason, Jason got taken down, but he recovered. Now he's back on top. Now Flynn's on top. Well, there is no top. Flynn looks like he might be going for his arm. Oh, he's got a Kimura in. He's got a... Oh, he tapped. Tap. Great. You got it. You're right. Beautiful. You called it literally a microsecond before the tap. Yep. That's a basic Kimura shoulder lock. Call it what you want. Um, and no holds barred and, and no gi grappling. It's very effective. Because the counter to that is when you get caught in that, that, uh, that arm lock, 
The counter to that is to hold on, like, if, in jiu -jitsu, Hold on to your gi. Yeah, you hold on to your gi. And, and, so you can't pull your arm out. Exactly. And uh, in, virtually in jiu-jitsu, you don't even see anybody going for that anymore because the defense is so easy. You just hold on to your belt, or your gi top, your gi pants. But it, with, without a gi, it's very effective. Right. We have a winner by tap out for Mr. Jason Flynn. Great fight, great technique. Very um, technical fight. Yeah, I'd like to see him fight. Wasn't any kind again. of a ground and pound thing. I mean, just a nice, smooth, nice finishing move. Okay, I'm here with Jason Flynn, who just won with a Kimura, right? Uh, how'd you set that up, Jason? Well, I thought I knocked him out the right hand. Didn't happen. Let it kept on going. Grapple back and forth. He's a strong guy. It's ended up going down. Saw it, went for it. God bless everybody, man.